Fighter reputation is almost there. Magical reputation could use a hand. Social reputation could use a hand. <sighs> Lumberjack, 18 gold a day. Perfect. And we'll send her to school in... Protocol? Yeah, protocol. Why not? It'll improve her decorum. Or actually, no. We'll send her to school... We can afford it. So we'll send her to school in poetry as well. Yay, I got my salary! Okay. We're almost there with the social reputation. Let's just go to the festival. Fuck it, I don't need to talk to any- uh, We don't need to talk to anybody. <laughs> And do we want to enter her in the dance party? No, because that won't do us any good. Let's try the combat tournament. Just try it. Why not? Okay. Who is Renee up against first? Where is Renee? Renee Twitch is going up against Horst Heimelman. Uh, Horst, I think, is pretty low ranking. He's only of middling skill. He's a swordsman, so wish us luck. If we win this match, we also get a little bit of uh, cash windfall, a little bit of money. 166 gold, it's not a lot, but you know. We're going to attack. He dodges. Actually, her MP is only 39, but look at his uh, magical reputation. So let's try magic and see what that does. He took 11 damage. So that's something. We'll attack him though, because her strength is ridiculous. Dodges. Hmm. So I guess Renee is also technically of middling skill, so. Oh jeez, honey, look at your forehead. Aw. It's okay, sweetie. <laughs> we'll go home and bandage you. It would have been nice to win, but oh well. We tried. As usual, it's Masal Halabar. I remember him. Shut up, Cube. Nothing wrong with being a tough chick. Nothing wrong with being a tough chick. I fell a tree by myself. Felled? Is it felled a tree? Come to think of that, that kind of makes me a lumberjack. <laughs> uh, sorry, everyone. That was lame. I guess Renee was so stressed out that she just lost interest in her classes. That's okay. Oh, hello. I am Paimon. I look over success and prestige. Please help me. Please improve her reputations. <laughs> Come on, social reputation. Oh, her decorum went up. That's equally good. Okay, social reputation is now 117. I guess that kind of makes up for the fact that she wasn't really paying attention in class towards the end there, but whatever. Uh, she's not stressed out, but let's see who we can talk to. Uh, can we talk to the Minister of State? He appreciates intelligence, so... Ooh, her popularity is going up. That's good. Well, we're getting there. <laughs> her magical reputation is the most distressing stat right now. Uh, social reputation she only needs 140 of. And we're getting that through school, uh, mostly taking the uh, protocol classes and uh, poetry class because, well, they're pretty cheap. Uh, magic reputation, that magic class is just so expensive. But the graveyard job opened up, so we might be doing that on top of uh, her regular lumberjack job. So let's just work. Uh, the graveyard job is more stressful. And it doesn't pay as well as the lumberjack job, but it does improve her magical defense. So we'll just take some time off at the end of the month, and it'll give her some pocket money. Okay, things are starting to finally look less dire. <laughs> oh, it's still bad, though. How many months has it been since I last said something about this girl? <laughs> oh, jeez. Uh, we'll just send her to work as a lumberjack again. We'll send her to school in fighting because it's cheap and we'll give her some time off and then the festival is coming up soon so we'll be able to try the um well the fighting competition again 
Okay, so the good news is we finally have the fighter reputation where we need it to be. But we still need to work on her social reputation and her magical reputation. So I guess now at least I can focus on the skills that need it the most. That need my focus the most. Oh, whoops. Did not mean to pick masonry. Her social re reputation needs help. That's one of the harder ones to increase. Her magical reputation needs help. Let's just go fight. Whatever. <laughs> I don't care anymore. Salam Nasir. This doesn't bode well for us. He's not one of the lower ranking fighters, you know? Oh my god. Why couldn't we go against Horst again? Oh, uh, well shoot, we have to attack. It's not like there's anything else we can do. She does hit hard though, that's something. Nothing for it but to you know, continue training, I guess. Oh well. Fighting and magic and all that, you know, the combat endings aren't really what we're going for anyway. It's just that this is the easiest way for us to improve her reputation, so. And I say easy, like it's been working, but <laughs> whatever. Did you guys see that? Marthia just challenged our daughter, who I'm training to become a lumberjack, to the cooking contest. I guess because her housework reputation is so high now. Great. <laughs> anyway, let's just talk to the Archbishop because we can talk to him now. Here we go. And then go work some more. Ooh, hello. Blah, blah, blah. Hello, Faye. Okay. Oh, good, our magical skill went up, which gives us a boost to our magical reputation. So fighter reputation is finally where it needs to be. Magical reputation is steadily going up. It took a while, but we're getting there. Social reputation is still... Well, it's almost there, but uh, I've taken a break from working on that. And then housework reputation is good to go. So I guess we'll just uh, focus on magic and art classes for now. So we'll talk to the Archbishop again. Boost that popularity. I don't even know what popularity does. Oh well. Finally, her social reputation is where we need it to be. But her magical reputation is the only thing that's lacking now. Which is great because it means we can finally focus. So we'll just talk to the Archbishop. Because that popularity is so nice. <laughs> and then we'll send her to work as a lumberjack. To pat out the wallet a little bit. Uh, we'll have her rest at the end of the month, and then next month we'll go to school. So, you know, just so that we have some money before we actually go to school. Ha! We did it! <laughs> All we need now is for the fortune teller to come and visit us and tell us that we're going to get the lumberjack ending. Uh, though this is just the part time requirement, so we're gonna keep fighting and we're gonna try to get the full time requirement. So, let's just make it to the festival, and I'll just keep doing what I've been doing. So, focusing on those three stats, basically. Four stats, sorry. Okay, I just got my salary. Our reputations are looking... okay. So, it doesn't really matter what competition we enter into this time. So, let's just go to the festival, and we'll do something that doesn't get her hurt. Okay, well, Marthia won. Not super surprised. Oh well, we only got 41 points, probably because we're not really focusing on cooking. Whatever. <laughs> we weren't going to win any of the competitions. Ooh, fortune teller. Yes, please tell our fortune. Please tell us she's going to be a lumberjack. Yes! Ha! We're almost there! I am liking this. We could do nothing for the rest of the game, and she'd be set. She's gonna be a lumberjack. So what we're gonna do? Oh well, uh, right. This is we're already friends with the Archbishop. Uh, Archbishop, excuse me. What we're gonna do is we're send. We're going to send her to work. We're going to send her to school, and we are going to focus on improving her stats to get to the full time position. So, fighting school. Uh, time off, and then. Let's go from there. Oh, and uh, she just got another race, apparently. 